What's up everybody, coming at you again with another little grocery type pickup video or whatever. Uh, just some different stuff, nothing like really that was in the last video. And not really much of this is groceries, but I went to the health food store, Harris Teeter, and the vitamin shop. Anyway, I got back home not long ago. You see, I got, new, got my hair cut. It's kind of how I used to wear it. It's actually a little bit shorter, shorter I think. So I got it pretty short. You can see it there. But it feels good. I think it looks good. I need to get cleaned up. Anyway, all right. So Harris Teeter, what I went there for was this here. Annie Chung's Cracked Pepper and Herbs uh, Savory Roasted Korean Seaweed. Seaweed's super good for you. Kind of dark, I just kind of got the, the, I got those lights on. And I'm trying to let the natty light and come in here a little bit, but seaweed. Oh, dang, you my chest. What? Anyway, <laughs> I'm just playing. Anyway, seaweed, uh, there's a book called like the, the longest living people on the earth and people went around to different tribes or groups of people and found out why they thought they lived that long basically and one group said you know, they thought it was they they attributed their long life to uh seaweed so gonna put that obviously they say that they're living long as crap i'm gonna put that in my diet as well anyway super good i've already cracked open one bag here they come in little sheets I just like the uh, the pepper and herbs is my favorite flavor. There's only three flavors: this, wasabi, and something else. But it's just a little sheet. Comes in a little tray. I think there's 20 sheets in there. Servings 10 sheets. Uh, per 10 sheets, there's 25 calories, two fat, one carb, one fiber, one protein, and 25% vitamin C. That's based on 2,000 calorie diet, but. It's a lot of vitamin C for 25 calories. So, nutrients dense. That. Okay, from there I went to the health food store. What I got there was some all natural uh, soap. I don't like using, because most mainstream soaps and so they have garbage in them. So, this, oh, it smells so amazing. It's uh, Dr. Woods coconut milk with vanilla beans and papaya. It's all natural ingredients and stuff on the back. It's so amazing. I've gotten this uh, quite a few times. I love the way it smells so much. Anyway, got that. Also picked up some all natural shampoo. Just go to your health food store. I'm telling you. And I picked up this deodorant. I actually tried, this is the deodorant I got last time or the time before. And this is the kind I have now. I'm actually meant to get this kind again, but I got this kind. I just, I'm trying different ones out to see which ones work better. These two work pretty good though so far. I tried the little rock crystal spray one time. It was terrible, didn't work at all. These actually work somewhat. Uh, I think this might work a little bit better than this one. I'm not 100% sure. I meant to get this one, but I got that max. Anyway, but no aluminum, no anything like that. All the ingredients on the back there, all natural ingredients, you know what I'm saying? I'm all about natural food, right? Organic food and like healthy food. The same thing about supplements. I put them like on everything I'm putting on my body, right? Your body absorbs a lot of stuff through the pores, so you got to keep that in mind. So I got those. Same thing with my tooth toothpaste. It's fluoride free. Fluoride's not really good for you. Trust me, it's kind of it's not good for you at all. Look it up and tell me. Dentists and stuff say it's supposed to be good for it's not good for you at all. Uh, but all natural toothpaste that I get, I can dive in that fluoride rabbit hole, but I'm not. That take me away off the course of the video, so I'm not gonna do that. But all natural, just I'm trying to kind of show y'all again what I get, and maybe hopefully inspire you or make you do a positive change in your life. Uh, slowly get those garbage. Like uh, I know a lot of aluminums and a lot of mainstream uh, deodorant and uh, fluorides and a lot of mainstream toothpaste. Like the aluminum has been shown like you can lower your testosterone. And that kind of deodorant stuff actually it's it's antiperspirant, which means anti-sweat, right? So that's actually clogging your pores, not allow you to sweat really. 
is what it's trying to do, right? But with this, it doesn't make you stop sweating. It just takes away the smell, right? So give natural stuff a try. I said there's tons of uh, brands. Just make sure they're clean brands and stuff. Uh, and even the stuff I put in my hair, I'll go grab it really quick. All natural hairstyling foam. It's by Giovanni. Anyway, all natural stuff is what I'm trying to say. Uh, the name brand of this is... I have no idea. Oh, well, the, the price tag's over it. I don't know what it says. Uh, Aubrey is the brand name of the shampoo. They got a bunch of different kinds. Uh, Spry is the name of the toothpaste. They got cinnamon flavor too, but I like the... What is that? The mint? Or whatever peppermint, yeah, I like that. Uh, there's a tons of the like our healthy store has a tons of other different kind of. Uh, damn, can uh, so <laughs> lost for words, but anyway, I'm telling you, make the switch. Thank me later. Your body will thank you as well. Okay, so from there, I went to vitamin shop, and I was looking. For, I used to take MSM powder. That's supposed to be, that's what's in like a bunch of plant, like, uh, plants and like, spinach has MSM in it, but it's like naturally occurring, right? But anyway, I was looking for some MSM powder, that's what I used to take, and I stopped taking it because I kind of experimented to see if I noticed any kind of difference or whatever. So I got up to like, I swear like 15, 17 or something grams, no, or 12 grams a day, or 13 grams, is where I got up to MSM and I stopped, uh, been doing some research on it or have in the past and there's there's no real studies showing that I found or last time I researched that MSM protects doing anything but MSM with glucosamine has been shown in studies to you know keep your joints healthy protect against joint wear and tear and all that so they didn't have powder that's what I wanted but I got this liquid here uh, it's by nature's answer liquid glucosamine kind of hot Chondrotin, chondrotin, I don't really know how to say that word. It's got MSM in it too. So, starting this, uh, there's 64 servings in it. So, I'm going to start with just one serving a day. That's what it says on here, but you can't always follow that because, I mean, it's suggesting one serving, but think for a 100 pound lady. So, you're saying a 100 pound lady should take just as much as a 300 pound guy or a 230 pound guy, you know what I'm saying? So, I'm just going to start with that and slowly work my way up. I'll probably stay at one for about a week and then next week I'll go up to two servings a day just slowly ramp it up because when I was on MSM I, I jumped up like crazy I started getting a little like almost like rashes on my skin that were itching like crazy and I looked that up and it was just saying it's kind of a detoxifying effect but I stopped for a couple days and started back and then went away anyway so from there went to Food Lion and I only got a couple, I'm not showing you everything I got from Food Line, just a couple things that are different from the last video. Uh, turmeric, super, 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 super anti-inflammatory. This may have been in the last video or another video, I'm not 100% sure. But I'm going to throw it in there again because I had to pick up a new one. It's basically like a natural ibuprofen. Super good for what I'm Look it up. I'll probably make a video in the future about turmeric by itself, a whole video for it. And this is the turkey I get. If you haven't seen the channel before, it's 98% lean ground. This is the best calorie to protein, protein ratio, like the least amount of calories to the most amount of protein in any meat I've ever seen. Uh, 120 calories, 27 grams of protein. So you don't want to always, be, so basically you can eat less meat with this and get in more protein. So that's one reason I like it as well. And when I'm cutting, I don't want to, you know what I'm saying? I just have less calories to get my protein in and that frees up more calories for fats and carbs. But I hope this helped. I just want to share it with y'all some other healthy things I do. For me, it's all about being healthy. I want to help other people try to be healthy. So uh, it's a little bit deeper, you know what I'm saying? Just nutrition and exercise. You got to you gotta be uh, mindful of, like I said, the things you're putting on your body as well. Things you're brushing, you know, brushing your teeth and things like that. So it's going to be it for the video. hope y'all enjoyed it. Uh, like it if you did. Share it if you did. If you would, that'd be awesome. Help me uh, spread the word, you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to help people on their fitness and health journey, you know what I'm saying? Because I'm on mine too. I may just be a little bit further ahead of you. So I'm trying to share the stuff I've learned and research to speed up your process, save you a little time. So you ain't got to sit down and research all the stuff I've researched. Anyway, that's it for the video. Comment, let me know what y'all want to see on the channel. 
Check back in with y'all in the next video. Peace, everybody.